Hi everyone, welcome to the video series on applets. So this is the fifth video and in this video we are going to learn about the status window. Status window. Now let us see where the status window present. Now in this applet viewer, if you carefully observe, so at the bottom we have a small box. So this is going to be called as a status window. Status window and what about this box so this box it is called as a applet window it is called as applet window now if you want to display any message in this status window so we have to use a method called show status show status method and if you want to display any message in this applet window so we have to use a method called drawstring method so we already know about this drawstring and in this video you have to know about this show status this is the only point about the show status and this question can be asked for maximum of two marks that's it so if you come to the theory part an applet can output a message to the status window of a browser or maybe applet viewer by using a message called by using a method called show status method now now what is the use of this status window yes it is used to give the user feedback about what is occurring in the applet as well as it is used to give some suggestions also possibly report some types of errors so these are the users of this status window and in case if this question is asked for 5 marks, then you have to write this a simple program. So uh, everybody know about this, right? Import statements and this is the applet tag. I have already discussed about these things in the previous videos. If anybody don't know about this, go and watch the previous videos. And this is my applet. This is my applet which extends the applet class. So this is the init method and this is the paint method now my concentration is mainly on this paint method so here if you carefully observe i wrote only two statements first one is g dot drawstring i already told you so if you use this method it will display the string in the applet window so it will display a string in this applet window and if you use this show status method it will display this string in the status window right so this is applet window and this is the status window okay so this is the, about the status window topic thank you for watching